Welcome to another cooking video. Today I got a little special addition for you because as some of you may notice, this is not food, this is a laptop. And this is my sister's laptop to be precise. She brought it to me because she spilled a little bit of water over it and she thought it was broken. So she brought it to me to see if I could fix it. I even bought um, some screwdrivers for it to open it up. And so I used a pick to uh, remove the backside, the plastic backside. And I then removed the M.2 drive, which is actually pretty nice um, to recover files. But then I noticed something weird, and that's that the RAM slot is actually empty. So as you can see, this is a sodium slot for DDR4 memory, and there is no RAM stick in it. So I checked the other side of the motherboard as well. I opened this whole thing up, no RAM in this computer. Pretty fucking weird. But you know, as you do, putting no RAM into those uh, slots. Thanks Asus. So, also another small thing, they didn't actually uh, attach these screws. So the left side of the screen was actually loose. So I, I just put some of the screws that were from the back side, I just put them here. <laughs> what a weird laptop. Okay, back to the food. So this is the food for today. Pretty easy again, because I'm a student and I don't cook difficult food anyways. So this is not for food, for eating, this is for drinking. Um, so today I'm gonna make some potatoes. I'm not gonna eat all of those, of course, because this is a whole kilo. A little too much for my taste. Um, and then I got some schnitzels. Chicken schnitzels, but they're actually vegetarian. They're from the same brand as the from the previous video, as you, I'm sure you've watched. Um, these are pretty good. They taste they taste pretty good, but they don't make good gravy. And I like gravy over my uh, potatoes. So that's what the onions are for, and a lot of herbs that are just herbs that are just there. Herb, <laughs> smoke the herb. Um, and we got the actual herb itself. My favorite vegetable, the broccoli, because it's so versatile. And of course, some butter to make the gravy. Very cool. Cheers. Going well. Broccoli has been cut. Time for a break. I put uh, broccoli in with the potatoes, they're cooking, very good, and then the other part of my recipe, the two schnitzels with the onion. Sometimes as a chef you gotta make hard decisions, and today I've decided that this one is not going in, you're going back onto the bench. Very nice. 